guys, it's Munchies and More and today we are trying Happy Lemon. We tried a few drinks from there um, a while back, but we're gonna do some drinks here and there that's new and then a waffle too that we've never tried before. Actually, we haven't tried neither. So I guess we can start with the waffles first. We're gonna try with the chocolate waffle that they have. There we go. It's a bubble waffle. Happy Lemon specializes in mm. specialty drinks, so teas and milk, milk teas, boba drinks, all that sort of stuff. And they also make bubble waffles. You guys, this is really good. Okay. You can taste the chocolate. And I like it's not too chocolatey. And you can taste the waffle. You definitely have that perfect chocolate waffle taste right down the middle and the bubbles are like nice and airy mm -hmm. so like oh when you bite into them very bubbly there's like an airy thing going on in there definitely get yourself something to drink because this will get you thirsty for sure so let's try the other waffle that we got It's a hot day today, you guys. And we're here in San Diego. Out here at the park. Happy Lemon also has other um, locations throughout the state. Um, in America. So we'll definitely let you guys know um, what other states do have Happy Lemon. So this is the cheese one. It's a, it's a more savory option. Some of the other options are more sweet. Oh wow, this one they actually put cheese in the little pockets. Oh my God. Kind of tough to see it, but. I like this way better than the chocolate. Mm. Right? Mm -hmm. I know it sounds weird, like cheese and a waffle, like what the heck? It's actually so good. It's so good, you guys. So good. Mm. I don't even know what type of cheese they do. Look, I keep going back for some more. It's definitely a different type of cheese. A different type of waffle. They don't load it up too much on the cheese, so you can still taste the waffle, which is nice. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Like sweet and savory. Mm -hmm. So, we got four drinks. I got the Oreo milk tea. I got it without the boba. They do have topping choices or um, different boba flavors. So, you know, like regular boba, there's mango. They have lychee. Yeah, they have a lot, so here we go. Oh my God. What drink is that? It's the Oreo. So the if Oreo, I shake it up, you Oreo guys, milk tea with boba. Yeah, you guys can definitely Popcorn. see the Oreo up in there. Mm -hmm. So if you love Oreo cookies, that drink's for you. Oh, Good, it's, right? It's so, so nice and refreshing on a hot day. It's, uh, it's got a nice tea flavor to it, but the creaminess, of the puff cream and the Oreo kind of comes together, gives it yeah. a nice flavor. So now we're gonna go for milk tea, just regular milk tea with some puff cream. And I did add boba, regular boba flavor. And on top of the puff cream, they add something, I think it's most, what is it? The green stuff? Oh, salted cheese. Salted cheese, so. Yeah. So here's the regular milk tea. I don't really wanna tilt the top a little, but there's the puff cream. So here I go. I can't stop eating this cheese waffle. Man. So, I know the chocolate waffle's like, what about me? Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm. It's good. If you love boba, they have some bomb boba here, you guys. Definitely worth a try. Some of their locations are in malls. So maybe check mm -hmm. your local mall and see if there's a Happy Lemon location available close to you. Um, they are expanding. I'm gonna try this one they're too. They're gonna open more. Um, they plan to open more. 
So I really do see them being like, like a brand that you're gonna see more often. I hope. So moving on to the next drink. I went ahead and got a uh, boba milk tea with puff cream. Pretty basic, a little different. Yeah, um, I know I was thinking, are they the same, but they're not. Are they? No, mine's just milk tea. Milk tea, oh, yeah, it's the puff cream that makes the difference there. So yours is milk tea with salted cheese and boba, and this one's a boba milk tea with puff cream. No salted cheese So mine didn't one. have puff cream then. Yeah, and no, no salted cheese in this one. But they did have a lot of some type of cream. I'm eating the chocolate so it doesn't feel left alone. <laughs> Missy? The puff cream makes the textures of the drinks like so much creamier. It's very nice. It kicks up the milkiness. It's the only way I could describe it. Puff cream is made out of, what is it made out of? Like just, what type of cheese? I don't think it's made out of cheese. I think it's just like a cream that they kind of whip up. But I'm not entirely sure what it's made out oh, of. Oh wow. But yeah, it's like a sweet cream. It's almost like it's not whipped cream, yeah. it's like a thicker, less sweet whipped cream, I would say. Whipped cream than puff cream you should get. No. <laughs> okay. Last drink. The last drink I got was the strawberry green tea with salted cheese. But this one, they have an option for their salted cheese that's tiramisu salted cheese. So you can see it looks kind of gnarly, but on the top of this, there's like a chocolatey tiramisu sort of layer. I'm gonna try to mix this a little bit. I don't know how well it'll mix right now, but. You can probably take the straw out and, and just put your it. finger. Yeah. That's a good idea. A little bit of mixer. Put the straw back in. Taste test. Oh, wow. Hold on, I wanna like get towards the top too. How does it taste like? Dude, that's actually so bomb. Like the bottom is like strawberry green tea because the tiramisu hasn't reached it as much, but the further up you go, it's got that chocolatey tiramisu. It's like a dessert and a drink, dude. Like I can't even explain it. And there's nice chunks of strawberry in the green tea as well. It tastes like, it tastes like gum to me. I don't know. It's the for me. It's the tea taste. The tea taste is very strong at the bottom. Um, it's not bad, but I'm not a fan of it. I love it. This one, this one, I think stands out from the others because it's a tea. But there's definitely just something about like the tiramisu salted cheese. It almost like it almost doesn't work with it, but I like it. Like I would give this like an eight out of ten for sure. But I would give most of their drinks an 8 out of 10, honestly. So. Well, I'll definitely say my favorite waffle is the cheese one and the chocolate. Because that's different. That's really different. You don't see that at other places. My favorite drinks in order, I would say my first one would say um, the Oreo. Definitely like the one that Tyler got, the milk tea with the puff cream. Then the regular um, milk tea. And then the strawberries last. For me. I think I would go Oreo with puff cream, then the strawberry green tea, and then the, the two milk teas. Maybe the puff cream before the salted cheese. Yeah. The salted cheese definitely- I love salted. But... Yeah, it makes it different. It's not, and don't think that because it's called salted cheese, it's salted. It's not, it's not. The, it's the just... sweetness of the drinks balances mm -hmm. out the saltiness. Exactly really good what about the waffles for you your I favorite's think, the cheese right? yeah i think i like the cheese waffle just a little bit more than the chocolate but it all depends on the kind of mood that you're in whether yeah. you're wanting something sweet or salty right they do have like original waffle too if you don't feel like any flavors and then what other flavor that they have is i think like the jasmine waffle or something right yeah they have a matcha waffle at certain locations not at our local location but maybe, maybe one day we'll get to try that matcha waffle. But alrighty, it's getting hot out here, so yeah. we're gonna go for a little walk around the lake, enjoy the drinks Show some you guys more. Some, 
uh, show you guys our view of the lake here at the park. Yeah, thank you guys for joining us to try Happy Lemon. We hope Happy you guys lemon. enjoyed. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for all the support, you guys. Thanks, guys.